bonjour et bienvenue dans le concert de la semaine. Alors, la semaine dernière, on vous a emmené au Nouveau Casino pour vous faire découvrir un groupe qui s'appelait la Cadet Bostani. C'était vraiment chouette. Et par contre, cette semaine, on va aller vers un autre style au Sunset Sunside. Alors, vous allez voir, elle s'appelle Chloé Charles. Elle est très gentille. Elle nous vient de Toronto. Et je vais devoir causer en anglais. Souhaitez-moi bonne chance. Salut Boy, girl, I like your business. I like your business. Girl, I like your business. Oh, let's have a good I come from a pretty artsy family. I grew up in a forest. Um, it was very inspiring. And then my, my mother was sort of on the quaint side of life, and my father lived in Europe, and so I went back and forth a lot and um, sort of fell in love with it over here. I decided to go to school for psychology because I thought that that was normal. And then I realized that I couldn't do that. It wasn't my passion. And so the minute I graduated, I just decided to pick up a guitar and start playing shows. And it snowballed, and here we are now. <laughs> It's so diverse. I mean, I love, like, artists that I really loved growing up, I, of course, I mean, I was into Radiohead when I was younger, and but I also loved a lot of, like, oldies and old folk. So Joni Mitchell, I really loved her album Blue, and um, um, some Puccini in the car with my mom, and so all of these different sounds, and Marvin Gaye, and it just kind of blended into my head. So I don't really think I have, like, one particular influence. And which kind of music do you think you, you, you play, I think, to your own point of view, mm. I mean? Um, I guess I wouldn't really give it a name. Maybe I would say it's like very um, expressive and dramatic, but that doesn't really, that's not a genre, but it should be a genre. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, it's just, to me, it's more emotional than it is like, you know, pop or jazz or folk. She told me of things I never see. She told me. Um, well, for me, I mean, the song has a different meaning than than it does as the title, if that makes sense. Um, but the core meaning is sort of coming to terms and accepting that not everything in life is balanced, and that's okay because I am kind of. An extreme person. I mean, most people meet me and think I'm very bubbly and cheerful, and but at the same time, I can be very heavy and dark. And I think I was always looking for some sort of moderation, but um, in the end, I think that's just who I am. And hey, you know, it's okay. <laughs> well, I guess you could say it was maybe all in all two years, but. That's including when some songs were written, like, but they were written sort of at different points over, you know, a couple of years. And um, the recording process, I mean, was probably only a month of, you know, but but spaced out. So we took a long time. Yeah. It's a different kind of scene there. I think in North America it's different, first of all, because our history of culture is not as old as it is over here. So people, um, you don't have the history of going and like, res you know, showing the same sort of support and respect for artists as I think you do say in France. Um, I don't know if that makes it harder or, or what, but uh, it's a very, very saturated, um, industry, lots and lots of amazing artists, lots and lots of great bands, and uh, people just, I have think, have a hard time going out because they don't know what to choose, and <laughs> they just like, yeah, they don't like spending money, but, you know. To 
one person? Can it be like a band or? Yeah. <laughs> Anyone um, you want. <laughs> <laughs> um, really, I would like to play with. Can I say an orchestra, like the Berliner Philharmonie? Is yeah. Berlin, that. Yeah. that mm. An orchestra. Yeah. Anyone? <laughs> Maybe not anyone. The Berlin Orchestra is amazing, so I picked that one for now. Okay. <laughs> and it's your first time in France. Your first show. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> I think you know France. No problem. Uh, are you anxious uh, for the f this first show because of the public? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm excited. I'm happy. Yeah, it's really cool. So far, I feel like um, my music sort of makes more sense in France than in some other places, so, yeah. C'est quand même cool, donc on va arrêter le rock'n'roll dans le concert de la semaine. Et moi je vous dis à une prochaine. Salut